Hey everybody, what's going on? Joe from Power Breaks USA. We are breaking some Strix tonight. The pre-release, happy pre-release. It's finally here. The Harry Potter set of Magic the Gathering. Strixhaven, School of Mages. I'm not saying it's Harry Potter, but Close to being Harry Potter. So in any case, uh, we are ready to crack this set booster open. These are what's available right now, at least locally for me. And I heard that they were gonna start delaying shipment on the, excuse me, draft boosters. So with draft boosters, Maybe not gonna be out in time. I'm glad I pre-ordered this one. Uh, very happy. By the way, if you can't tell, I'm nasally tonight. Uh, seasonal allergies are getting the best of me. Yeah. Went from like really nice weather out here in Kansas City to like dumpy, cold, and rainy. So, hey, maybe I could sound like Kermit the Frog. Or since I'm in Kansas City, I can sound like our football hero. I'm not going to say names. I don't want to come back being like, oh, this guy talked mad smack about this dude. No, I was joking. So anyways, uh, we are going to crack open Strixhaven tonight. Super excited about it. Um, I will say that we are... Uh, I don't know how many more of these I can get right now. I wish I... I, I want to tell more of a story about this, but like this is, this is it right now as we speak. Hopefully I can get some more in the coming uh, days. I'll check that website that I bought them on. Because my, my LGS that I go to, they uh, they do everything contactless when it comes to payment. Everything has to go online. So with that being said, um, I'm gonna show you the first hit before we even open this box. Boom. Buy a box. You gotta love buy boxes. Dragon's Guard Elite. Metal Craft. I don't know if you guys have been playing uh, Arena today, but Arena had the update. Is it yesterday? Yeah, yesterday had the update for Strixhaven. And man, people are just playing Metal Craft like. Or, I'm sorry, Mage Craft. I keep saying Metal Craft. Metal Craft, I think, was with uh, Artifacts. Mage Craft. So when you cast an instant or sorcery whatever creature is out that has magecraft that you own there's a certain trigger and this one puts a plus one plus one counter on it now you could also double the number of plus one plus one counters on them for six mana two green and four colorless um, could be useful late game my beef my beef all the time with pumping things up is did it have trample or flying or vigilance or double strike or first strike you really kind of have to juice up this dragon's guard elite in my opinion to make it uh, a big threat but it could definitely grow and kill the board early on this guy only costs two mana so with that being said you are the first hit dragon's guard so there you go well other than that, we could start cracking open the Strixie box here. So this is the, uh, the, the set boosters. This one has the art cards. Let's see, prestigious Academy of Unparalleled Magics. And there's all your, your schools. Your Silver Quill, Prismari, Witherbloom, Lorehold, and Quandrix. They are all named after an Elder Dragon. Pretty cool stuff. I'm just excited to get to open this. 
I love cracking packs. This is what I do. Cracking the packies. So let's bust it open, shall we? See what we get. Gotta say, I've been partaking in a couple breaks out there. And uh, I'm, I'm happy with what I see. I think we're still too early to know how well this set is going to have an effect on standard and the meta in general. But I do believe we'll see it. Uh, we'll see everything change here in the next few weeks. You know, we used to just be able to do tournaments out there in the world, and you can kind of see what everyone was playing. All right, so how do I want to do this? I think, yeah, I'm going to take this out. I'm going to take these out. Take them out. Take me out. Oh, that didn't work. We're just going to pop that right there so we can kind of keep Strixhaven in the background. So here we go. Kraken, Strixhaven. I'm not going to you know, shuffle these up. I'm just going to start opening them. Now, I think I'll consider all mythic hits. So if we uh, open a mythic, it automatically gets the air horn sound. It's my only sound effect that I really like to use right now. All right, see, we got we got our card. Love the art cards. We've got uh, an island. Looks like we're going backwards on this, huh? Got introduction to annihilation. I'm gonna keep everything together, actually. The pop, pop up. Zephyr boots, umbral juke, mascot interception, practical research. Explosive Welcome, Mentor's Guidance, Conspiracy Theorist is our one, our first rare. <clears throat> what does he do? A lot of Conspiracy Theorists out there these days. Uh, you may pay one mana and discard a card if you do draw. So when he attacks, you pay one. Whenever you discard one or more non-land cards, you may exile one of them to your graveyard. If you do, you may cast it this turn. Okay. Pestilent Cauldron. Looks like we got a little strategic planning. Robert Trevino art. Very pretty. Wish that was foil. Oh, and here's our foil. Symmetry Sage. And we got a list card with Evermind. Yeah. So again, these are having list cards. If you're familiar with the last few sets that came out, they had an extra card from you know, whatever the history of magic, you could always depict it by this little magic symbol down there. See it? Very cool. Keep going here. Art, 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 art cards. Oh, this one's got a rare in the beginning. Illuminate history. These are weird packs. I need to get used to that. Here's our trick. There you go. Get that light. Study break. Cogwork activist. Or I'm sorry, ar archivist. Berry in books. Reject. Witherbloom apprentice. Bookworm. Exponential growth. Until the end of turn, double target creatures X power X times. Yeah, that's going in my Hydra EDH deck. Wandering Archaic. Uh, it may be an Avatar, but does anybody feel like this is an Eldrazi? I have this theory that the Eldrazi may have not just been contained in one area, but my part of my theory is also that there are good Eldrazi out there. And maybe, just maybe, this is what these Avatars are on uh, Strixhaven. Instrix Haven. Got a grape shot. That's a great, uh, great new art by uh, Mintu Heinen and Beaming Defiance. 
We also have a Magic Minigame Careful Study Guide. This is a little off. I feel like there's there's a little more, uh, it's a little shifted to, to the, well, I'm looking at it, so to the right. Nice. Next. Hey, if you're out there, shoot me uh, a line in the chat. Say hi. Share the stream with whoever you can. Mountain. Okay, Pest Summoning. Biblioplex, Biblioplex Assistant. Needlethorn Drake, kind of one of my favorite ones to draft right now. I've only done a couple drafts on Arena, but that's been my go-to. A Flyer with Death Touch. Can't go wrong with that ever for two mana. Barag Befuddler. Arcane Subtraction. The Honor Troll is on the Honor Roll. Good for life gain decks. Fortifying Drought. Another Conspiracy Theorist. They're popping up everywhere, aren't they? Tendrils of Agony. Beautiful art. I love the way these cards look. I'm just going to keep saying that every time I open one. Field Trip is Foil. And an Elemental... Sorry. An Elemental Token. Well, that's cool. That's a nice little art card there. What is that? That's Brainstorm. There's two people doing that art. Justin and Alexis Hernandez. Yeah, that's pretty dope. Swamp, another pest summoning, illustrious historian, excavated wall, tome shredder. It's a wolf. It's a red wolf. Thrilling discovery, shade wing laureate, laureate, thunderous orator. Killian, you know, when your father is Dean Ambrose, second best really isn't an option. Anyone feeling this kid might be uh, kind of a trust fund kid or what? Semester's End and Divine Gambit. That's beautiful art, too. Foil is Exhilarating Elocution. I'm just going to be grabbing randomly. If they don't look even, I'm just going to grab them. I'm not really paying attention. So if you notice that I'm grabbing from the top when I have a, a whatever row and I shouldn't be, well, oh well. That's what I say. Swamp, okay, we got the Mercu Mercurial, Mercurial Transformation. Stone Rise Spirit. Come on, I know you can get it. Just look at the line. Look at the line. Okay, pillow, Pillar Drop Warden. Pilgrim of the Ages. Great card. The white. Fuming Effigy. Pillar Drop Rescuer. Another Killian. Reflective Golem. We've got a, uh, a rare Culling Ritual. I mean, it's not a Mark Tiedon memory lapse, but it's a memory lapse that's been done by Katrina Colientes. Colientes. Secret Rendezvous foil. No list card there. At the end of this uh, box, we'll have a little special break too for you guys. Ooh, a foil island. I love foil basics. Reduced to memory, pigment storm, spectacle mage, silver quill apprentice, shadow of confidence, dueling coach, Carrick wrangler, wither bloom command is our rare, or one of them at least. We've got an Augmenter Pugilist, or Pugilist. It's 
Beautiful card, 3-3, three, three. as long as you control 8 or more lands, you get plus 5, plus 5. For 3 mana, to get an 8-8, eight, eight. are you kidding me? And the back of it is the Echoing Equation, and you choose target creature you control, each other creature you control becomes a copy of it until end of turn, except those creatures aren't legendary if the chosen creature is legendary. Uh, yeah. This one's probably going to be a really hot card coming up here soon. Duress and Campus Guide. No list card. But you get a pest. Kusmina. Right? Kazmina. Said her name wrong. Got a mountain. Possibly the most overpowered card in the set. It is a colorless card that lets you search for a li search your library for a basic card, reveal it, and put it to your hand. Not only that, you gain two life. And all that value for two mana. Two. Two colorless. You can put this in anything. Owl and Shield Mage, Combat Professor, Lorehold Pledge Mage. This is a pretty good card lately because it's got First Strike. It's been kind of being a pain in the butt to me on Arena. Lorehold Campus, Enthusiastic Study, Carrick Wrangler, Tenured Pink Caster. I haven't seen that one yet. Nice. Poet's Quill for a rare. We got a Tainted Pack. All right. And that is, you know what it is. What is it? That's a hit. <laughs> Lovely. Got a Tainted Pack. That's our first, uh, our first mythic. Right? Yeah, I didn't pass any other mythics up. I don't believe I did. And then we've got the uh, Wither Bloom, Pledge Mage, and Justice. Oh, it should be a Fractal. Cool. We got one mythic so far. Looks so like we got the uh, Star Pupil. Is that the Robert Pattinson character? Introduction to Prophecy. Great little lesson there. Campus, uh, Quandrix Campus. Big play. Lorehold Excavation. Got a legendary Quintorius Field Historian. Reconstruct History. Lorehold Apprentice. This is like a Lorehold like pack. pack. Return Pass Collar. Look, it's all Boros, dude. Or, sorry, Loreholder. Village Rights. Beautiful foil. Then we got an Eliminate foil. Wow. And a Fractal. What's that Eliminate foil go for? I mean, it's still too, it's still too early for any of these things to be of, like, guaranteed value because, well... The set actually releases in a week. And so everything's on speculation at this point. Nothing's really on definites. I should say absolutes, because the Sith only speak in absolutes. All right. I love this card, the Professor of Zuma Zumanzi. That just reminds me of like one of your friends that you have you know you know you got a big old teddy bear as a friend somewhere island another lesson of environmental sciences i really hope we can get a foil one of this in this in this box soothsayer adept quandrix pledge mage quandrix campus dina soul steeper tend the pests uh dagmoth woe eater We've got the uh, eye twitch. It's an eye bat. 
It's not just a bat. It's an eye bat. We got Blade Historian as our rare. And a cool lightning bolt. I still prefer the uh, old Christopher Rush. Quandrix Apprentice. And an Avatar token. All right. Let's keep rolling here. This is uh, Arrogant Poet. Or likely from Silver Quill. Fractal Summoning, which I happen to really like this card. You get to create a 0 0 green and blue fractal, excuse me, creature token. And then with the X, you get to put the X plus one plus one counters on it. I don't know, I like, I like that. Curate, Biblioplex Assistant, Needlethorn Drake, Reckless Amplomancer, Burug Befuddler, the Honor Troll is on the Honor Roll. Fortifying dra Drought, for Draught, so this should be Draft, right? The D-R-A-U-H-T, no, Draft. Oh, got a Mythic, Blot Out the Sky. Oh yeah! What you got? Oh, I'm gonna th I'm gonna blot out the sky. Yeah, yes. I'm not gonna look to see what the other card is. That's two mythics so far. Essentially, that's how I could really judge everything. Just in the first day of opening these, is if it's a mythic, it's a hit. Pretty simple. All right. Oh, snap. We got a demonic tutor. Yeah. Two mythics in one pack. Holy moly. I'm going to look at the next card. I just said I didn't want to look at the next card. I didn't know what was there. Wow. That's, uh, that's pretty awesome, dude. Any anytime you get a demonic tutor, it's, it's, dude. Seriously, it's like one of the best cards in, in the history of Magic the Gathering. And it's useful in every era past three, 30 years. I'm just gonna say 30 years. We're only two years away from it being 30 years. So I'm just gonna say, it's almost three decades of dominance at this point. And then our foil is Blood Age General. And we get a Spear Token. That Spear Token is pretty cool. Looks like it's a red and white spirit token. Wow, Demonic Tutor. That's fantastic. So we've gotten two of those um, alternate art cards in, um, in Mythic. Card's that. Rise of Extus. It's pretty wicked art. We've got a Foil Planes. Inkling Summoning, Curate. We haven't had a, a, another rare in the front like we did on that earlier pack. I wonder if that was a mistake. Needlehorn Drake, Reckless Amplomancer, Fuddler, Test of Talents, Flunk. We've got uh, Vine Glimmer Snarl. These snarls, from what I gather, are just kind of a, a filler for this set. Let's do the time warp again, baby. We've got another mythic alternate art, whatever you call it. That's awesome. Oh, and then a gift of a state's foil. I'm gonna tell you what, I'm gonna put them both on the hit list. Wow. We're already four deep with mythics in this box. That is awesome. Gift of Estates, as you know, the last art had like an elephant on it. Uh, this is not an elephant art. This is another Justin and Alexis Hernandez art. We saw their art earlier for Brainstorm on the art card. That's fantastic. We're gonna move this over a little bit there. 
I'm gonna run out of these holders tonight. Yeah! Have to move these dice out of the way is what we're gonna have to do. Okay, that was everything. Nope. Did we do it? Yeah, we did everything. We did it all. All right. Looks like we've got a list card. It's on the back. Hang on, I gotta sip my tea. Tea. All right. Looks like we've got that uh, copy card. What is that? Echoing Equation as the art card. Planes, fractal summoning, square up. I like this card. I think it's going to be very useful going forward. Serpentine curve, biomathematician. Hello. Looks like this one's going to be a Quandrix pack. Leyline invocation. Eureka moment. Love that card. Devouring tendrils. Brackish trudge. We've got another, we've got another. Wow. How crazy is this? Dude, what's going on? We got one, two, three, four. This is our fifth one. And then we got Adventure Impulse and Moon Mist is our list card. Back in the day in a shrug. Jeez. We're even halfway through this this box. This is a stellar box by any standard. If you get this many mythics in it, I just <clears throat> remember going through boxes and only getting like one or two mythics, and we're getting we're already up to one, two, three, four, five mythics. God, that demonic tutor is so pretty. Very thick pack. Oh, sorry. Okay. Move that, by the way. Not doing my, my, my thing right here. Okay. Got the uh, Shade Wing Laureate. Planes. Reduce to memory. Expel. Got a Stonebound Mentor. Got a Stone Rise Spirit. Got a Pillar Drop Warden. Pilgrim of the Ages. Reflective Golem. Got a legendary cr creature, Rutha, Mercurial Artist. Chris Brown's a great artist, too. Strixhaven Stadium, where they play Quidditch. I mean, whatever the game is on Magic. We've got Whirlwind Denial, beautiful card. Our foil is Hall Monitor, which is a Lizard Shaman. Okay, I'm not a fan of this song. I think I've heard it before. We're just gonna... Here we go. We'll go back to this. Kind of a calm night here. A couple viewers, thanks for tuning in. Appreciate you guys, really do. I even checked. Hang on, before I start doing this. Let me check the Facebook to make sure that. Uh, we're not getting any any chatting on there. Well, we are good right now, so but I'll leave that up just in case. All right, here we go. Art card is we already had this one. This was a uh, bio biomathematician. Biomathematician. We got a forest. Cool little forest. Add a paquette. You know him and his lands. He does great. Introduction to Annihilation. Lesson. Blood Age General. Study Break. 
Rutha. Got Ingenious Inspiration. Overgrown Arch. Oh, man. Another Mythic. I'm not complaining. I'm just in awe that there are this many Mythics in this, in this box. <laughs> Another Mythic? This is crazy. <laughs> you guys. Wow. Thrill of Possibility. Moldering Carrick. Oh, we got a Yabamaya Scion. Protection from Artifacts. A 4-4 uh, creature from uh, Urza's... Uh, whatchamacallit back in the day. Wow. So... Two more Mythics. Thus bringing the total number to seven, which is probably the most now that I've seen. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna move that over there. Put the uh, Sandrix Silver Quill over there, Elder Dragon. I didn't even like begin to take a look at this one. Hang on a second. Before we put this up, we got Rowan. Scholar of Sparks. Let's go. There's so many mythics back there that it's hard to, it's not giving it a chance to, okay. So anyways, Will is on the other side. Scholar of Frost. So Will and, Will and uh, Rowan are back, Rowan and Will. They're back as a dual card. Wow, I am just, I'm, I'm crazy impressed right now by this box. I've never, I've never seen it like this. Seven, seven mythics. And we still have a good way to go. Pretty crazy stuff here. Only on Power Breaks USA, people. Only on Power Breaks USA will you see the closest thing to a god pack or god box that you'll find out there. Wow. Valentin, Dean of the Vein. Looks like he's the Dean. Containment Breach. Waterfall Aerialists. Prismari Pledge Mage. Prismari Campus. Tenured Incaster. Closing Statement. Humiliate. Shade Wing. We have Baleful Mastery as our rare. <laughs> Another Mythic. Primal Command. <laughs> Another Mythic. Professor Onyx. Slam. Da 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 da. Let Liliana be Liliana because this is a foil. Lily. Holy crap, dude. Seriously. This is ridiculous. This is absolutely insane. I need to get people to see this. We are just cranking. Cranking Mythics. I don't even have enough stands at this point. And why is that? Because most boxes don't have this many Mythics. I just got both Planeswalkers that are in this set. Is there another Planeswalker? Oh, Luca, I think, is still in here. Wow, dude. That's all I gotta say is wow. All right, so here's what we gotta do. We gotta free up some stuff here. So, I know Gift of Estates is a great card. But that's got to go back there. I can't believe this. I honestly cannot believe this. So all the Mythics up front right now. Two, four, six, eight, nine Mythics in this set. They're in this box right now. Nine Mythics. We got one more stand. 
I need to take a break here for a second, and I just need to shoot somebody a message on this because this is crazy. So yeah, wow. I, I can't, I, that, that pack was just, if you're drafting this box, this is ridiculous. I have never seen this many. I still have, I'm gonna count the packs. Two, four, five. Two, four, five, so there's 10. Two, four, five. 15, 15 packs are still left in this box. And I've opened nine mythics. Maddie, this is ridiculous, man. I had, I, had to let, I had to let a friend know, Matt Yip, great dude. He's kind of like the Obi-Wan for me in breaking, but dude, I'm telling you right now, nine, yeah, dude, foil lily, foil lily, full art. Dude, I, I'm, I'm telling you, man, this is uh, this is insane. I, I don't know what else to tell you except this is just freaking insane. I have never opened a box like this in my years of playing Magic and opening Magic. This is ridiculous. Now, Matt, I was hoping that Demonic Tutor would be foil, but I'll still take a Demonic Tutor no matter what. <laughs> all right, we're going to continue going. That's all we could really do at this point is we're just going to keep going. I am just, uh, man, nuts. So we've got 15 packs. I'm telling you, man, this is just, uh, I'm in awe right now. I'm like hot. I'm like warm. Like I, a box has never done that to me ever. Like I'm like five minutes from calling my mom and she's not going to even understand what the hell's even going on. <laughs> oh, crazy. Wow. Well, thanks for joining us, Matt. I really appreciate it, seriously. But damn, dude. Wow. I don't want to open the rest of these. I just want to, like, sell the rest of the packs. Got Verdant Mastery. Keon, Dean of Substance. Abuse, right? Am I right? Ha, ha, ha. We got Urza's Rage. This is a great box. This is just a great box. Biomathematician foil. We got we we got a list card. We got Huatuo. Uh, he, I just dude, I just bought the I just uh, put this card in a C EDH deck like I don't know about six months ago and dismantled him the other day because it was so good. Wow. List card goes there. Woo. This is nuts. Like, I need more like people to see this. <laughs> After this video is done, I need to like spread this video around because this is just fucking insane. Pardon my French. Wow. Crazy. Still in awe. If I open up any more mythics, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna quit and go to bed. There's no need to continue. Got an elite spellbinder. Weather the storm. I just love this art. I just love the way that this art. Like, dude, Justin and Alexis Hernandez, they might be like my favorite artists coming up here now. Gotta solve the equation. And a mini game card. Which I just dropped. It just fell on the ground. Leave it. Holy moly. 
the nine mythic box. We gotta go for a cool ten, right? The double digi. Is that what we're aiming for? I mean, I'm shoot. I'm aiming for like a twenty-five mythic box. This is the closest thing to a god box I've seen. See, here it is again. Okay, so this one has a rare in the, in the beginning. I haven't seen that before. <laughs> yeah, dude. Matt, these are all my cards, too. Like, I didn't break this, like, for anybody. This is this is my personal box. So, damn. I'm telling you what. If I pull another Lily, you and I will talk about the... Uh, about the foil full art lily. Did you end up getting a regular lily at all? Thanks, man. Appreciate it. <laughs> snarl. Gotta throw the snarls in there. I mean, hey, we'll take them. Opt. It's good art. Pop quiz. Treasure token. Like that, 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 I'm sorry, that pack was like normal. That was a normal pack. I felt good about that one. I don't, I don't know what else, what else to do here. Except keep going and breaking. <laughs> Planes, spanning, uh, an, 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 anatomy, anatomy, anatomy. Ugh, can't even talk. I have a major cold going on right now, so my words are not properly formulating. Rika moment, blank, silver quill silencer, we gotta claim the firstborn, novice dissector, treasure token. So Matt, did you pull a lily yet for yourself? Scratch, make sure this is square up. Manifestation Sage, Flame Scroll Celebrant, Snakeskin Veil, Cool Art, Study Break, Study Break and Study Up. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna you have to wait. Wait, you're doing Japanese altars, the alternates. Don't you have to buy a Japanese uh, box for that? If that's the case, I need to get in on that. Like for reals. I'm still in awe, dude. I mean, I, I feel like the rest of this box is going to be underwhelming. But I'd really like to see, I'd really like to, to eat my words on that and be surprised that there's maybe two more mythics in this, this box. Deadly Brew. We got a Frost Burl Snarl. I think we got almost all the Snarls now. Uvilda, Dean of Perfection. It's a nice outfit. And a regular Gift of Estates this time. Leech Fanatic and a Spirit Token. Collector's English has Japanese... Okay. Did not know that. That is something I might have to shoot for. If you go deep, I might have to join you. Let me know when those post up. Our buddy Matt Yip here is the one of the two hosts of uh, Break Drakes, and uh, they do some kick-ass breaks, man. That's why I was calling Maddie the uh, the Obi Wan of Breakers, because dude, he just he knows he's he's got it going on. But this is amazing. This is just oh man. 
I'm just uh, having a good time here breaking cards. Ah, there it is. The Bibliopex. Why was this not a legendary land? Why was this not legendary? I mean, it's the Biblioplex. How many Biblioplexes are there? I thought this is the Biblioplex. Got to cultivate. Jason Felix. I wonder if he stole that art. Devouring Tendrils. We got Brink of Madness. That's a great card. Yeah, little art, little uh, list card. It's it's definitely underrated. You gotta know how to play it though, right? That's that's how cards stay underrated because you need you need to know how they how they pop off and and uh, work with other cards. There's the uh, Sadrix. Oh, Biblioplex. Sorry, yeah, Biblioplex is underrated. Should have been a mythic. Just so I could say there was 10 mythics. Dalek would fall too. I got myself a Niv Mizzic uh, deck that, uh, it's a wheel deck. People at the table don't like. And there's number 10. Full art, Shadrick Silver Quill. I, I, don't, I don't know what else to do except like DJ Khaled this bitch. We're the best! <laughs> oh man so I got a regular and I got the full art a mana type and then thrilling discovery wow there's number 10 number 10 10 10 get out of here dude and I'm telling you this is 10 I'm lining up the mythics at, right here like this is it 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 with two, four, six, seven packs left. Oh my god, I'm crushing everything now. Just because they're mythics, they're not immune to my destructive clumsiness. Alright, seven more packs. That's ten. Ten mythics. This isn't like a big deal to many people, but like I don't remember ever pulling a box that had 10 mythics. I've been pulling others, like the Commander Legends usually have like five or six. Thanks, man. I wish uh, I wish it was an actual break. I wish it was an actual like. Yeah, you too, man. We'll see ya. Thanks for stopping in. Appreciate you. Mountain, Spirit Summoning, Archivist, Burying Books, Reject, Curate, Mortality Spear, Wither Bloom Apprentice, Bookworm. We've got multiple choice. Is that our second thrust? We've got a Foil Vanishing Verse. Trying to make it through the night. Five more packs after this. We did not get a list card. I can tell you that. Elemental summoning. Pop quiz, wormhole serpent. We got Archmage, Archmage Emeritus. When you cast or copy an instant sorcerer, so I'll draw a card for Magecraft. Pretty cool. Shock, who shocked you? Infused with Vitality. Elemental. Seriously. Twitch viewers, you should get on this right now. This has been ridiculous. Forest. Oh. That, uh... Let's see if I can get this on a better angle. See that? 
Just open that pack and it's, it's all bent up. Is anything else bent? No, everything else looks okay. Dude, this box is sick. Radiant Scroll Wielder, Eliminate, Foil Wormhole Serpent, List Card, Voldalian Ill uh, Illusionist, Tart Creature phases out. You have to tap it? Yeah, you have to tap it. So you untap it too if you need to. You phase another creature out. Oh, okay, four more packs. So we got both art of the Shadrix Silver Quill. Oh, there's a signed card. Who's this one? Dragon's, Ga Dragon's Guard Elite. So this is the uh, Dragon's Guard, this is the Fire Box one. And that's uh, Darken. Magic Artist Extraordinaire. So you got Confront the Past, the Rare in the Front. Does that mean we're gonna have any uh, mythics in the back here? Got a gnarled professor and a swords to plowshares. Umbral juke. Eh, we got another list card. Venerated teacher. It's very fitting that a teacher card would be in Strixhaven in the, for the list. So when it enters the battlefield, put two level counters on each creature you control with level up. So for those who don't know level up, probably the most recent card would be Hex Drinker out of uh, the last master set that came out. And um, essentially when you level up, there's it triggers the creature to get bigger or uh, activate an ability. Whether that be flying or death touch or with hex drinker protection from, I believe, everything. Uh. Who is this? Who, who is this? That's uh, Imbraham, Dean of Theory. What a great box. This could have all in common and I still won't care. Dramatic Finale. Tezzeret's Gambit. And a foil snakeskin veil. Oh, and a list card. Cradle Guard. Trample. Echo. What is Echo? During your next upkeep, after this permanent comes under your play, uh, under your control, pay its casting cost or sack it. A good amount of list cards too. I am just over the moon right now with this box. Got a Retriever Phoenix. I should really do a Phoenix deck. We got Defiant Strike. And Burag the Fuddler. Last pack of the box. You cannot go wrong with any of this. This was a sick ass box. Very simple. <clears throat> That's the uh, Galazeth Prismari. <laughs> Got two dragons in this box, but they're the same dragon. I'm not complaining, by the way. Shadrix, which I'm just gonna call Shadrock. 
the old Beastie Boys song. Deadly Brew. Draconic Intervention. Torrent Sculptor. And Revitalize. Pilgrim for the Ages. Spirit. So let's recap this nonsense that we call a set booster box. Seriously. This is freaking ridiculous. To lead off where I think the most value is probably at is Professor Onyx full art foil beautiful I wish they made her lines a little because you know how she's got the purple lines I'm not saying this to be uh, gross or perverted because I'm pointing at her chest but that's really the only area and even her face we'll even go her face like I feel like they should have extension oh, you know what you could actually see the lines when you put it in the light hang on let me see there you go see that you can see the lines. I was hoping you could do that. I was hoping you could see that. So we got Professor Onyx. We got both arts for Shadrick Silver Quill. I'm just gonna put those guys together. No, nope, I'll put them separate. <clears throat> we got a time warp, which just super useful in any EDH deck that's got blue in it. Tainted Pack. Blot out the sky. Hang on, I wanna look at, I wanna show you this tainted pack thing real quick. I just saw this on the bottom. Let's see if this is Okay. So it is shifted. The stamp is shifted a little bit. Not much. But enough to send people in a frenzy sometimes. We did blot out the sky. We got our boy Nickel. Is that Nickel Bolas in the back? You think? Does that look like Nickel Bolas, or is that like some kind of demon? It's got to be a demon. This is demonic tutor. Demons prefer to deal with those who believe themselves too wise to be fooled. That's great. I don't know why it looked like nickel bowls because they have a train for those horns. Primal Command. Fantastic card. We got Rowan and Will hanging out, partying with us. And the last uh, mythic is the Magma Opus. And then the two other hits that we had in here were the first one was our Buy a Box. I was considering that a hit in the beginning. It's not really a hit anymore. Toss it away. And then Gift of Estates Foil with the uh, Hernandez arc. Pretty awesome. Looks great, right? So, I want to put these guys, I'm just going to put everything away. Hang on. The rares need to go where rares are going to go. Because we're gonna we're gonna open up something else. Let's continue our quest for more, more, more. Wow, Lily foil. That is fantastic. Seriously, what what a box. What a box. So I am going to, since it is a pre-release, we're going to open up, whoop, hello, we're going to open up a pre-release uh, deck, or I'm sorry, box, kit, pack, pack, it's a, it's a silver curl pack. Okay. So, 
so I went with Silver Quill because it was either that or Quandrix. Um, but I was really hoping, and it's still obviously could still happen, but uh, I was really hoping for the Lily or Shadrix. So I pulled both of them out of this box that I just opened. Plus, I haven't gotten a black dice in a long time. Really haven't. Semester's End is our promo. Making sure it looks good. No crimps. that a little bit. Let's look to see what's inside. We get a divider for Silver Quill and we get the uh, College of Eloquence. Excellent. Little poster, little mini poster. Pretty cool. Their packages are always really nice. I, I gotta give it up to Wizards of the Coast for, or Hasbro, I don't know who's in charge, but since it comes out of Wizards' uh, idea pod, I feel like I can give them both credit. Hasbro for distributing it, Wizards of the Coast for creating it. Guys, I'm still in awe right now of 10 Mythics in this box. That's it. Okay. So... We got the semester's end. Uh, open this one up. I don't know what this has in it. I'm kind of unfamiliar with the pre-release kits, so don't uh, hate me for my ignorance. So I could have just read the box. And these are all cards geared towards Silver Quill. Got a Silver Quill Command, Spirit, Pest, and then uh, that's used for double sided cards. Pretty cool. This box was gross, dude. It was so good. All right. Prismari Pledge Mage, Rise of Exodus, Letter of Acceptance, Spiteful Squad, Reckless Am uh, Amplomancer, Mage Hunters Onslaught. That's a story spotlight card. I read that. Exodus stood before his alma mater for a moment, remembering first his studies, then his vengeance. At his command, the Mage Hunters unfolded. So Exodus does not like the school. Exus must be the uh, Voldemort. Got an Augmenter Pugilist. I, I told you this card is freaking awesome. Got Infuriate. The Treasure Token. I can't believe this, this box still. Let me see. I'm just going to mute the conversation right now for one hour. I don't need them to sit there and keep chatting with me here. Some other breakers. Dragon's Approach, Mage Duel, Pest Summoning, Prismari Apprentice, Containment Breach, 
show of confidence and the biblioplex. So we were really excited to talk about this earlier. The nice thing is you get to look at the top card of your library. If it's an instant or sorcery card, you may reveal it and put it into your hand. If you don't put that card into your hand, you may put it into your graveyard. Activate that if you only have exactly zero, zero or seven cards in your hand. No ifs, ands, or buts. There's another mythic for the day. Natural order. I freaking love natural order. I really do. It's in, I think I own like maybe two of them, now three. Uh, it goes into my green deck, so it always goes into my green decks. Natural order. Ooh. It's good stuff. That'll be our 11th mythic for the day. It's all about that mythic life. Yomo, you only mythic once. No, apparently not for me though. I'll take another one of those packs though all day. The one that had the lily and the silver coil dragon. Radiant scroll wielder. We got agonizing remorse. An avatar token. <clears throat> Two more packs. Got ourselves, oh, looks like we got a list card. Archivist. Wow. Another conspiracy theorist. I almost have a play play uh, uh, play set of conspiracy theorists. That's three for the day. So that wasn't a list card. Thought it was a list card, it's not. Double-sided token thingy. Which, by the way, I think I'm gonna start doing some um, alters on those. Make fun proxies with them. Big play. Navis to Sector. You tell I'm getting tired because I just stopped talking. I like gave all my energy for like that last box. Honor Troll, Ingenious Mastery, and we got a Grape Shot Rare. So, to sum up this one, we got Natural Order. I mean, that is, I'll take that any day. I love. Not only the list cards, but now they're doing like, you know, these alternate art cards for older, um, older cards. So the alternate art for the older cards. I think it's badass. Well, I would have loved to talk and chat tonight, but at the end of the day, I don't think I need to. I just, the, the cards speak for themselves today. They just, uh, they're flowing. Mythics were flowing like, like, I don't know, like a waterfall, man. They were doing great today. So, I wanna let you all know, thank you very much for tuning in if you tuned in and check this out. Um, don't forget to subscribe and like. We're on Twitch, we're on YouTube. Uh, I'm now on, uh, or we're now on um, Instagram. I did an Instagram finally to set that up today. And then uh, Facebook, definitely Facebook because that's where most of our information is for our breaks. But if you uh, check us out anywhere to watch, check us out here on Twitch. We're most comfortable doing it on Twitch here. And uh, thanks for tuning in. Appreciate y'all. 
Go Strixhaven. We'll see you.